Ugh, today is the first day of school. I do not want to go. I hate my teacher, Miss Green. She always gives me homework of some kind on the first day. I really do not want to go. Damn it, my dad is going to come in and say, get your little ass into your school or you will be grounded. Rosie, it is time to go to school. Please walk over to my car for me to drop you off. Ugh, fine. Dad, may we get McDonald's along the way? No, you can have breakfast at school. If you behave today, you can get McDonald's after school. Ugh, I guess I will have the crappy food at school. Oh hey look, we are here. Have a good day, Rosie. You too, Dad. Also, remember to behave, or else you will be grounded. Ugh, I already hate it here. It is so boring, I just want to do something else. Something else. Oh, that gives me an idea. I will sneak out of the school when the bell rings and I will head into the fields, where I usually like to go. That is the bell, time to sneak out of the school. Good morning class, I am Miss Green. I welcome you all back to Hillbilly High School. Before I go over who I am, I will take attendance. Damien. I am here. Jessica. Let's see. Nuke is absent. Caillou. Here. Rosie. Rosie. Oh, well I am marking her as absent. Alright class, let me tell you a little bit about me. My name is Miss Green, I come from the San Diego area of California. My favorite thing to do is work with you guys. I want a... <laughs> Boys, shut up, I am trying to speak, can't you see? Anyway, I won a doctor's degree in college for mathematics. That will be the first subject we will learn today. Let's all refresh your mind and start with simple math. Caillou, what is 5 times 4? Um. It is 20, right? Yeah, I am pretty sure it's 20. I will go with 20. That is correct, Caillou. For tonight's homework assignment, I will give you all 10 basic math questions, and you will all finish it before tomorrow morning. Anyway, let's get back to practicing more math. Ah, I like it out here. A nice cool 65 degrees Fahrenheit out here, birds singing, no stupid teachers, and peacefulness. I like it out here. Alright, before you all go to lunch, remember to complete the 10 problems of basic math on your worksheet I handed out to you. Also, remember to return here after lunch. Class dismissed. Hello Miss Green, what brings you here? Mr. Dave. One of my students, Rosie, is absent from class. She may have ditched class as she is my most misbehaved student in my teaching history. Do you have anything to show where Rosie is? As a matter of fact, I think I know where Rosie is. She usually likes to hang out at the field across the street. Boris did not call me either about Rosie being absent. She most likely ditched class. I will call Boris to see if he knows anything about this. Hey Boris, did you get my email? No, I will check that very quickly. Alright, thanks. I wonder who that could be. Hello. Hello, this is Mr. Dave. I am calling to Rosie and Caillou's teacher. Miss Green is saying that your daughter Rosie is absent from Miss Green's class. Is Rosie staying home today? What? Oh my god! No, she is not staying home. I took her to school today. She should be in school. Thank you for reminding me, I am heading over now to discipline her. Alright, bring her into my office when you find her. I will be hang up now. Bye. Dr. Wayne, I will be calling out early again. My daughter ditched class again. Alright, I will see you tomorrow, Boris. You too. God, Rosie is going to get it. I usually see her hide behind the tree at the field across the street. 
I will hopefully be able to catch her before she hides. Man, I am getting hungry. I probably should sneak back home to get some food. <laughs> Shit, that is my dad. I need to run. Rosie, I know you are hiding somewhere. Come out now or else you will get the belt. Whew, that was close. I am now going to get some food. Alright, I am back home. I am now going to eat my... Shit. Um, Rosie. Aren't you supposed to be in school right now? Um, there was no food in the cafeteria today. So I walked back home and... Cut it out with the shit. I know you are back here to avoid getting in trouble. I am going to call your father to see if he is looking for you. Hey Mr. Dave, I had no luck finding Rosie. She must be far away from the school. It is fine. I will be contacting your wife to see if she knows anything about this. Hello. Hey Boris, are you looking for Rosie? As a matter of fact, I am. The principal of the school called me and said that she ditched class. Do you know where Rosie is? Yes, in fact, she is right here with me. She claims that there was no food at the school, and she came back to get a snack. Alright, bring her into the living room. I will bring her over back to the school. Thank you for informing me. Bye. Bye. Rosie, you are coming with me into the living room. Your dad is going to pick you up and bring you back into the school. No 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 no. I should not have come home right now. Rosie, you are going to answer the door for dad. Ugh, fine. Rosie, get in the car. Now. Rosie. This is unacceptable behavior here at Hillbilly High School. Because you walked off school property, you will be serving a two hour after school detention with me today. No 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 no. Please, give me another chance. No, you should have learned from your mistakes. You have done this at least 20 times last year. I am so sick of it. Alright class. How was your lunch? It was good. Good. I am glad to hear. Anyway, let's go back into the educational process. We will now be doing some history. Jessica, who was the third president of the United States. It was Thomas Jefferson. Good. I think you will win a doctor degree like me in college. Okay, Rosie. What empire built the Great Pyramids of Giza? Your mom. Rosie. That was really offensive to me. You better not put a joke answer like that again. I am done. I hate you. I hate this class. I will now slap Jessica. Rosie 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 Rosie. How dare you assault one of your peers. Go to the headmaster's office now. Let me guess. You did something again, didn't you? What did you do? Nothing. I got sent to the principal's office for no damn reason. Rosie. I do not believe that. Miss Green has been teaching here for over 10 years, and she has not broken one rule in the educational process. What did you do for real? Um, 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 um. You are going to kill me when you hear this. I assaulted one of my students. Hi. Rosie, this is by far the worst thing you have done. How dare you assault one of your students. That is so freaking it, you will be suspended for five days. Get out of my school, now. I will be calling your father. No 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 no. Please, 
Give me another chance. Absolutely not. I am going to call your father now. Rosie, what he did a few minutes ago was even worse. When we get back home, you will be grounded for a long time. Dad, I'm sorry. Can I please at least go to McDonald's? No, you may not. I promised you that you would behave today and I would get you McDonald's. You broke that promise. If you did not do anything else other than walk off school property, you would have only been grounded for a week. Instead, I am going to have to ground you for the rest of the school year for assaulting one of your students. But I only slapped Jessica. Rosie, harming other students in any way is considered assault at the North Lake School District. When we get home, you will march right back up to your room. Go to your room now. Wow.